Good morning guys, welcome back to Field Trips Panama, welcome back to Los Buzos Resort. It's kind of a late night last night and an early morning this morning. It's shaping up to be a beautiful day, but today we are heading down to an epic spot, Moro Puerco, it's about eight miles down the coast to the east. Today we're actually doing some ponga fishing, got a couple clients that don't want to kayak fish, so they're going to be in the pond with me, we're going to be doing some trolling, some jigging, throwing big poppers, see what we can get into. We've been hearing reports of Wahoo, so that's kind of, I've never caught a Wahoo. That's really kind of top of my list today. We keep hearing that Wahoo have been around. So we're gonna see, never know. Like I said, I've never caught one, but that's the goal for today. But either way, all the clients are kind of getting ready. They're eating breakfast right now. I need to go change, get ready. We'll see you guys out on the water. It's gonna be a good day. It always is here at Los Buzos. <laughs> now we're gonna let them go, drop all the kayaks in, and then we'll transfer the three all over there. It's basically a big underwater mountain, a few of them. And it's good on the drop off on all sides. down if you want or you can stand up. All right. There you go, like a pro. You want to put this thing on there? It's not digging into you? I think you're all right. Here we go, first one of the day. Get around, babe. You got it. Hopefully it's a tuna, not a panina. Doing perfect. Let's see. It might be a tuna. Oh, no. That's a tuna. Oh, is that a tuna? That's the elephant tuna. Nice. Great work. Cool. Perfectly executed. Tenemos un bate. Yeah, we'll set that over and we'll get some pictures, huh? Oh, Tuna were harmed in the making yeah. of this video. Anita Moorhead from Oklahoma. Right here with her and her husband John. And first yellow and tuna in the boat. You did perfect. No critiques. Is that your first elephant tuna? Yeah. Oh yeah. You want a picture? Sweet. Got blood on everything. <laughs> oh, you get blood on Yeah, I know. Oh, that's okay. Oh man, thank you. Perfect. Alright, first one in the box. Nice job. Where are you guys at, Dakota? Just to the east, but uh, we keep seeing them jump way off in the distance, but like six feet out of here, easy, 60, 80 pounders. All right, we're gonna go after them? Roger. Shark bait. Ellos se ven, es como 60 o 80, yo digo. Lejos, pero vamos. Make sure you start reeling before you go down. Yeah. Because you don't want to slack the line by dropping it before you start reeling. Does that make sense? Oh, yeah. Might be a little better one, man. Or you never know. It could be something else. It could be something else. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, buddy. One thing you kind of need to do is like feed that line a little bit with your thumb. Kind of move it back and forth. 
doesn't have a level wind on it, which is the thing that automatically yeah. does it. You know? it back and forth. Yeah. Doesn't have to be perfect, just you just don't want it to all bunch up in one spot. It's coming up close here. Oh! Wahoo! Wahoo! Yeah! Man! I just thought look, the lure popped right out. Oh my gosh. First Wahoo I've ever had on the boat here. Woo! Look at that, man. Yeah. Nice. Amigo. Wahoo. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, there it is. Amigo. Wait. Have good luck. Mi primera mi vida. And mi bote. Dude, that is sick. All right, all right, Kerry, he's got really sharp teeth. Yeah, hit it hard, yeah, because we don't want it to flip out of the boat. Yeah, just hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. You can grab it in there in this gills, yeah? You got it nice and tight? You sure? Sure. Don't drop it. Yeah. All right, guys, been fishing here five years, never had a Wahoo caught my boat. John Moorhead here just reeled in this beauty. It's a pretty good one, too. One of the fastest fish on the planet and one of the tastiest fish on the planet. This guy is going to be dinner. Oh, I'm so stoked about that. We literally this morning, we're all talking about all the guys. We're talking about if we could just get a Wahoo today, how sweet would that be? And there it is. First, what, an hour? Less. Less than an hour? Yeah. Crazy sharp teeth, super fast fish. I told you, I was like, it might be something a little bigger. It might be something different. And there it was. There it was, man. Wahoo! Ah, oh, it's amazing. Cool. Yes! Y'all have two? What? Or y'all have one? Just got one stud. Yeah, nice. Look at this. The other boat just got a stud wahoo too. Huge wahoo. Oh man, no, that's a good one too. Oh yeah. Damn. Yeah. Look at that. The day of the wahoos. Phew. Just watch those teeth. Man, that is a good one. All right, we just ran over here to the kayaking group. We got three guys out here kayaking with Derek and Chris Allen here from California. Hooked up to something giant. Been fighting it for a while, I think. Whoo, you got it, bro. Yeah. Wow. We got Derek here guiding the kayaks. Well, we got two boats trolling around and jigging. Chris here. Going for a sleigh ride. Says already towed him a half mile. I think he's been fighting it for a while. He's looking pretty gassed. Yeah, you know, honestly, if it's pulling straight down, it's probably not a shark. A shark could be towing you out. You got it, buddy. Oh, Just careful off to the side. You think? Oh, really? What do you say? Shark? <laughs> Are you serious? Wow, Derek said he saw it. He said it's a giant shark. <laughs> he said it looks bigger than the kayak. <laughs> I've never seen a shark like that out here in Florida all the time, but. Vamos un poquito más cerca. Chris Allen here, hooked up to Jaws from the kayak. That's right, man, you never know out here. We don't catch many big sharks, but it looks heavy. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Right here, yeah. See it right here? Oh my God. Hey, baby. Wow. Oh, shit, Wow. Yikes, right there, right there. Woo! Woohoo! Careful. <laughs> Big shark. <laughs> is it close? That's a leader? Oh, yeah. Here he is. Oh! Yeah, he's big as your boat. You're gonna need a bigger boat. Oh, careful, he's under your boat. Yeah, that's all right. Wow.
Megan. Yeah. <laughs> he said, yeah. Bring him up. <laughs> <laughs> we, we could take the rod from you if you want. Yeah, we could help you over there. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, Chris, yeah, go ahead and Chris is like, yeah. yeah go ahead. Look at that. You want to tickle his nose? Yeah. <laughs> I want to see him out of the water. Oh, and it broke. It bit it off. Well, there's a little bucket list experience. Shark as big as your kayak. Nice work, buddy. A little worn out. Yeah, a little bit. No more big Bonita baits. Yeah. Los Buzos CrossFit. Right. Well, not too many people can say they've caught a shark as big as their as their boat. All right, you're up. Feels pretty big. What's that blue thing? I think you're gonna want it for this. All right, let's get down there. That honestly feels, it's a tuna, it's a pretty big one. Here, I'll take this, I'll get it. it. Yeah, it's right here. Thank you, man. That's a wahoo. Chris. He thinks it's a wahoo. This is on the other lure, the cedar plug. Just make sure you real faster when you go down or go down yeah. slower, one or the other. You don't want to drop it, you okay. you slack it, yeah. Quite a bit of line out on this one. See, you're dropping and then starting to reel. You gotta start okay. reeling before you even start going down. Go down slower and reel a little faster. Still, same thing, you're slacking it. Okay. So, right now you can just reel. I think you can just okay. reel. You just run into the boat now. Yeah, exactly. So, reel, we don't wanna slack it at all. We have to reel. Keep reeling faster, 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 faster. Just gotta keep it tight. It's the only way we can lose it now. Yeah, he's kind of coming at us, huh? <laughs> coming right at us. Might be a tuna. Doing perfect. Now we'll have to lift up. Oh, okay, he's going. Chris. <laughs> Saw the boat, he didn't like that. <laughs> I don't want him. Oh, tuna, tuna. Sweet. They're delicious too. That's... Man, oh yeah. okay, we're good. We're good. We're good now. Oh, whoop! He said I ain't done. Now reel. And go down. Pull it up. Reel. Okay, stop. Aha! Nice. Good job. Also great to eat yellowfin tuna. I think your other one was bigger. Huh? You don't I think I filmed on that. <laughs> I got it going, man. I get you all this stuff. <laughs> Golly, blood everywhere. Yeah. So with tuna, especially with really all fish, it's good. Cut their gills or stab them in the heart and, and, and get the blood all out of there. It keeps the meat a lot better tasting. Yeah, especially when he saw the boat, he took off. Yeah, he said, ah, I'm going down. And honestly, yeah, and I was kind of helping you. He was, he was digging hard. Yeah, So tough, Rachel's over there on it. It's our turn now, what the hell? <laughs> nice, look at these guys. More Wahoo. Hey. Wow. Have you guys gotten any Nah, it's been slow. Cuidado con la línea. We got two tuna in the Wahoo. We went and checked on the kayakers. They caught a shark the bigger than the kayak. Nice, meat 
looking good tonight. Nice fish on for John. Keep the rod higher. Yep, yep. There you go. Oh, oh, careful. Got it. Got something on. Tuna. Yellowfin tuna. Nicely done. Now that adds to your list. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. For the bingo? Oh yeah, that's right. Right, yeah, he hadn't had one. We hadn't had one yet. What did I catch one from? Wahoo. A wahoo. And a tuna. Oh, you caught two tunas. I caught she two She caught two tunas, tunas and you got the, okay. and you got a wahoo and, and a tuna. Yeah, you got that? Thank you, sir. Nice work, tuna for John, yellowfin. Beautiful fish and delicious to eat. Not too many tuna in Oklahoma, I'm guessing. No, no tuna there. <laughs> they need to come over here and put a few things in here, so. Wow, look at that thing. Wow. Damn. Bro. That's a stud. Man. Hell yeah. Did y'all have them tied out? Right. Eating good tonight. Give me some more ice now. Lagoon system, but there are also tons of caimans. Like oh, crocodile, yeah. oh, like that. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, babe. All right. There you go. Oh, I see it back there. It's on the, is that it on the circle. It's on the circle. It's on the huh? It's on top of the water. Yeah, I thought it was on top of the water. Oh, it's pretty good. Yeah, you can just reel like that. Mm -hmm. Just try to keep the rod tip up a little higher if you can. Yeah. Thank you, John. That's okay. Thank you, yeah. You want me to grab it? Don't thank me. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got you got it? it? Yeah. Thank you, then. That still helps a lot. No harm done. Uh, so you got it, dude. Anita's hooked up again. Let's see what we got. There you go. She's a seasoned veteran now. I've been very impressed all week. You know, a lot of times we get wives that come and they don't really care about doing anything. They don't want to try or do anything. You're you're the opposite. You're getting after it the whole trip. Maybe another tuna. Oh, oh. Oh, it's oh, it's bigger than it. Than it looks. Yeah, don't, don't keep the rod tip up. Amigo. Wahoo. 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 Uh, uh, it's better. Okay, just chill. Just chill. Watch the rod on the. Don't. Yep, just chill. Everyone chill. All right, reel up, reel up, reel up. Thank you, Amigo. Thank you. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Amigo. Uh, oh, 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 watch it off the boat. Oh, try to get it off the boat. Okay, real, 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 Yeah! Woo! Nice! Number two, Anita, the good luck jar. Look at that. Wow. Amigo. Ahí está. <laughs> Didn't he have me though? <laughs> he was really worried we were gonna lose it there. Oh yeah, I know. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, oh man. Grande. Wow. Grande. Yeah, that's bigger than the first one, I think. <laughs> Woo! You gotta show me up. Man. How about this? Oh. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Oh my gosh, amazing. Two in one day. There was a knife here. Oh, wait, I see thank it. You. I see it. Oh, wait, let's get pictures. Oh my gosh. Yeah, oh, oh, there you go. Oh, graceful. Oh, God, it's definitely heavier. 
All right, you got it? Yeah. He's dead. He should be dead. Yeah. Look at that. Anita. Anita more Wahoo. Anita more Wahoo. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's too big. I gotta get further back. All right, Wahoo number two for Anita here. Look at this, even bigger. They're getting bigger. Yeah. Gosh, great job. I saw it thrashing on the surface and I was like, that does not look like a tuna. And then when we saw it in the water there, I knew it wasn't. I've never caught in a Wahoo here and there's two in the boat today. Incredible job. Wahoo number four. Just, just now. Yeah. What a day, what a day. Day of the Wahoo. Just picked up a couple of kaggers, ready to head home. Wahoo is slimy too. What a day. Record day for Wahoo. <laughs> My first one I've ever caught. Podemos ir cerca de la costa cuando regresamos para poder verlo. Yeah. See, I understand. You got it. You own it. You're basically Latina now. Nice Spanglish. Spanglish. My little Hicksicans. Hicksicans. I like that. All right, ladies and gentlemen. The day of the Wahoos has come. We, uh, I've been itching to get on some wahoo. There's been a lot in the area. And finally today, we actually spent some time trolling and boom, four wahoos on the day, two in our boat, two in Dakota's boat. Absolutely epic. One of the best eating fish that swims and none of them are small. We went out today saying we want a wahoo. We were rigging up all morning, hoping to get into some wahoo and it worked out, it worked out. Garrett was with the kayakers. They got two roosters, a bunch of other stuff. Giant shark, one of the biggest sharks I've ever seen here. Just an epic day out at Moro Puerco. We're gonna be eating good tonight, ladies and gents. That's a good looking fillet, brother. And it's gonna be good. <laughs> well, well, that that no, it's for bait tomorrow. Bye, Wahoo's Bye, Wahoo. Wahoo Bente. Wahooga. Sashimi, we got tuna tataki, lightly seared. This stuff's so good. The cleanest, whitest meat. I don't remember ever eating it looks like this. It's like butter, melts in your mouth. Fantastic. Tuna tartare, raw tuna with some avocado. Man, the lighting's not doing it justice, but this looks amazing. Wahoo steaks going down. Doing these super simple, because why ruin a good thing? Wahoo steaks, we're going as simple as it gets. Not trying to mess up a good thing. This is one of the best eating fish on the entire planet. We're just searing them super hot on each side. Morris says that you want to get a nice, like, kind of crispy outside. 
It'll be mostly cooked through, but maybe with a little, the middle a little bit rare. You don't want to cook it all the way through. It's so good. I've only had Wahoo a handful of times in my life and it's never been bad. It's, it's just such a good fish. Burning the vegetables, worrying about the Wahoo. I'm just doing this for real. Alright, Wahoo's done, ready to go. You don't want to cook this to death. It's a good fish. Don't ruin it. Just a nice crispy sear on the outside. Probably a little bit raw, just right in the middle. Kind of medium rare type of deal here. Man, I'm so excited for this. That's gonna be good. Okay. Yeah, are we ready? Yeah, y'all go. Dinner's up! Wahoo tonight! Man, it's gonna be good. It's fried rice, basically. You got your friend's number? Yeah. Grab a spoon because you got soup over here. It's my propina, amigo. <laughs> Ooh-wee, Rachel looks good. Looks very good. Don't mess this pour up, Debbie. A lot of pressure. A lot of pressure going on there. All of you two is going to judge your salad dressing pour. That's right. Hey, you got a free shot for your first rooster fish. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, buddy. Steve here got his first rooster today on the kayak. Oh, we're getting makers. Makers. What do you mean we ain't getting? What are you talking about? He insist the client and the customer's always right, Morris. Oh damn, we ain't getting. Oh, we ain't getting both the getting makers. Steve here, great human being, insisted that I get a free shot with his first rooster shot. I don't know. It's just, it's just good people here at Los Buzos. I'm telling you, our clients are the best. I love you, man. We gotta take care of our guides. He's gonna be at my wedding for sure. <laughs> Okay, two good shots here. Uh, is that Jaeger for real? No, that's just a dark whiskey. I ain't doing that, <laughs> It's man. a dark whiskey. You said the client says whatever he says. Well, hey, he did not say anything about Jaeger. You said hey, Jaeger. You're the only one that said Jaeger. laughing already. <laughs> no way. That's funny. <laughs> I ain't, man. It's dark whiskey. Come on, tell him to suck it up. You all right? Suck actually, up. actually, I had a slippery fingers today. <laughs> oh, okay. Don't take it either way. No. Salud. Oh, Congrats, oh. brother. Congrats to Steve here. We're getting his first rooster. I'm getting punished. I don't know why. I'm gonna vomit. I'm gonna vomit for sure. Congrats, brother. Thank Truly. You, brother. I'm gonna vomit though. Half of that is punished by the fact that that was the last shot in that bottle of makers I opened right before I left. That might be related. I might be related, I might be related to that Nobody problem. I'm drinking makers but you. Alright, we got yeah, you. Yeah, I got one bite of Yeah, we're going to cut that one out. It's a family friendly show. The butt joke's got to go. <laughs> yeah, now it's super bad. I ruined everything. Alright, guys, Wahoo. First time eating Wahoo here at Los Buzos. Four Wahoo on the day. What a day. Stoked for this. As simple as it gets. Literally, there's pepper, tiny bit of salt, a little bit of garlic, seared, crispy outside, nothing else. All natural. It's got a little bite to it. It's got a little texture to it. Phenomenal. I knew it would be. Very clean tasting. Doesn't have like a taste, like a fishy taste. Doesn't have a. Oh, you can do whatever you want with it. Super clean meat. The Wahoo is just as good as we thought it would be. The group's incredible. Everyone, we're all having a good time. I just got conned into a shot at Jaeger. I don't even know how it happened. Steve, I blame Steve. We're all having fun. What an incredible trip. What a great week. There better be more men. I just had a bottle There better be a bottle somewhere. I think there's one more bottle. You'll come by. What's up? As far as I'm concerned, I'm leaving tomorrow, so let's let's finish it tonight. The whole new bottle. Let's finish it tonight. You're leaving tomorrow on Saturday. I'm definitely calling in sick tomorrow. It's my one sick day for the trip. So. Wahoo!
Mission accomplished. We had one goal today. Got it done. Delicious.